marrying a man or should I also say marrying a woman also that is great yes is actually especially in ministry in ministry it can actually be a life of sacrifice because you may not always have it your way and apart from that um, the man or the woman may not have or will not have 100% um, presence he or she will not be 100% present with you if you are not willing to live that life of sacrifice there's a possibility that you may take a wrong decision out of anger out of annoyance so when you see the wives of men of God when you see husbands that are married to women of God and then you see how they live their life do not just envy them because you do not know the sacrifices that comes with it this video was about prophet passion java say something as he was speaking to prophetess maggie elias and then i will let you to listen to what he said in this video new to this channel do well to subscribe click the notification button be part of the family lovey preaching 2 a.m in the bedroom right and the husband is just there next right. year I don't know if you understand. Yeah. So many people have to understand that spirituality can get into you and eat you so bad that you forget the power of your own marriage and you yeah. neglect your partner, right. be it being a man or being a woman, because there is this crazy move of God that you are watching online, being people slain under the power of God, being prophecies, being teaching, being everything. So people must be taught the time limit of being church people and the time to be good wives or husbands at all yeah which is very important it's like taking your work home exactly yeah and uh you know many people are maybe going to say something sweet or deep on that one many people wish to be you right because they want to be in your position right but they don't know how hard it is right. to be in your position right People, they think it's easy to own a building like this. They don't know what comes with it. People, they think it's good to just drive these fancy cars. They don't know what comes with it. Right. People, they don't know how hard it is to be with a man like Lovey. They think, ah, he's just a good guy. He's just a sweet guy. He's just love. <laughs> It's not going to be easy. I don't need to prophesy you. No. Uh, you, you don't need to prophesy me because marriage in itself is a different world right. than prophecy, than healing, than teaching. I don't know if I make sense to people. So there is tears that comes with what we do. There is pain that comes with whatever we do. Because to marry a man like Lovi, it takes what we call strong faith. You know the faith that brings down the walls of Jericho? That strong faith makes you marry a strong man. But it takes long faith to keep him. Yeah. So it's easy to get any man, but it's never easy to keep the same man. Yeah. How do you handle it? <laughs> I have you. Give us rich recovery. Yeah, honestly. And I, I remember you said one time you were here mm. maybe a year ago and you said if you're gonna be called to ten people, you're gonna be broken ten times. Mm. If you're gonna be called to a thousand people, you're gonna be broken a thousand times. Yes. If you're gonna be called to millions of people, you're gonna be broken a million times. And when we understand that, you realize that God is not compartmentalizing the sections of your life that he wants to break. Now, let me expose you to the people now. <laughs> so many people don't know why you have the wisdom to handle all their problems. Right. They don't know why you have the wisdom to tell them, in this situation, your marriage do like this. It's not prophetic. It's experience. That means she went through what you are going through now, and she overcame. That's why she has the solution to it. You just see a pretty woman dressed nice sitting in front of the camera and you think everything is okay. She has to go through any type of situations that you are going through for her to have the wisdom to give you. So being broken to 1,000 people, it means a thousand people that have cried different tears. She had to go through all those tears by herself in order to bless all the 1,000 people. I don't know if I make sense.